Hey everyone, welcome to Life Thoughts Camera YouTube channel. In today's video, I will be reviewing the Imperial Heritage Restaurant that is located in Sakileshpur, in the state of Karnataka, India. This is one of our pit stops that we visited during our trip from Bangalore city to Sakileshpur. About the brand, I was able to find their Facebook page. No information was mentioned about the history of the restaurant. Do check out the description box for the Facebook link. Getting to the restaurant. We stopped by this restaurant for lunch after we left Shettihali Rosary Church. This restaurant was on the way towards our homestay. I have shared the Google Map link in the description box below. My experience Finding the restaurant. It is located on the main road itself. It is on the right hand side and it is very easy to find. About the decor, it is an open style restaurant which is common for highway restaurants. Generally, much is not expected out of highway restaurants. Taking that into consideration, this place was not that bad. The brick walls and the tiled roofs would look really nice during the monsoon season. Not much decor has been done and they have also maintained the place. Service and food, this was just a pit stop for us. We visited during the lunch shift. The different dishes we ordered were Gobi Manchurian, which is a starter, and for the main course, we went with roti along with dal fry and a paneer curry. Most of the food served was hot and cooked well. We were happy with this. The service was a bit slow, even though the place was not packed. Do check out all my videos related to this trip. In and around the restaurant, since this was a pit stop, we did not do much sightseeing. Don't forget that the Shettihali Rosary Church and the Vrindavan Homestay are nearby this restaurant. Restaurant Facilities I have mentioned all the facilities here. Do pause the video to go through them. My Rating For location, I'll give it a 4. It was really good. As for ambience, I would say it was a 2. Cleanliness was not that bad, so I'll give it a 3. For decor also, I will give it a 3. Service could have been a little better. So I'm going to give it a 3.5. For the food presentation, also I'll give it a 3. Food taste and texture gets a 3. Value for money also is a 3. Overall rating, well, again, it's a 3. Final thoughts. It is a wallet-friendly restaurant and a good pit stop as they have food and washroom. Will I recommend this place to my friends? Yes, I will. Even though I have given this a 3 rating, I did not find any other restaurants during our trip and this worked out fine for us. I recommend this place for couples, family, friends, group and solo. And that's it guys. If you're interested in lifestyle, do check out my other videos. Now don't forget to thumbs up and if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. And then hit the bell icon to receive all notifications. Bye!